Hi guys, you can mind DHS here, back with another tutorial on how to set up an internal server, this time for patch 3.21.1.0. A couple of things have changed since the last video, but not much. Okay, so first thing you want to do, right click on turned properties, local files, browse local files. Then you want to right click on turned, create shortcut, go to the shortcut, right click on the shortcut, properties, and then after this there should be the two little uh, dashes, and then you want to go to the end, you want to take space, dash, no graphics, space, dash, batch, load, and then space, plus secure server. Now this is if you want to play with friends which uh, I'm assuming most of you do but if you just want to play by yourself or people in your network you can just put LAN server. But I'm gonna leave it as secure server. Then you want to do a slash and you want to put the name of your server. I'm just gonna put server1 just for testing. Then you want to go ahead and run that shortcut it can take a few seconds the first time, don't worry about it, nothing is wrong. Okay guys, hey, welcome back, and that's that finished now. Now, uh, you won't have all these things, this is just because I run a rocket server. If you want to know how to install all the rocket mods and are interested in that kind of thing, leave a like, subscribe, and comment down below for a tutorial. Now, what you want to do is shut down, just get rid of that. And then you want to go to servers, and you will see server 1 now. So you click on that. Uh, you won't have this rocket folder. Again, that's for the, the reasons I just described. And you want to go into server, commands.dat, right click, and edit with notepad++. Plus plus. Uh, do not. Now, there's a couple of things you want to put in here. Map. Uh, I'm going to put Washington name. I'm just going to call it ABC. That is your uh, public name, owner, and then you can put your Steam ID, which I'll leave a link in the description for you to find. PVE or PVP. It's up to you. I'm just going to leave it on PVE. Password. I'll set it to 123. Mode. This is the difficulty, so easy. Normal. Hard. Or gold. I'm going to leave it on normal. And then port. 27015 is one I recommend. It works very well if I'm turned. Max players. I'm going to set to 16. And then perspective you can either set it to both first or third so I'm going to set that to both then I'm going to save this and close it down so then you want to go back to unturned and you want to run the shortcut so while well that's loading you want to go to steam and then play unturned Then your server should be loading, and your unturned will be booting up. Okay, so now that we're unturned, you want to go to play, connect, uh, and then for this, you just want to type local host, and then the password that we put in was 123. And then you will get this, see it's on Washington, and then boom, you can join. And then you'll see as this loads, it'll load up, and we will be in Washington. Okay, so now you can see we're on Washington. Now, not everyone will be able to connect to this. Only people that are on your local network are being able to connect to this. If you want your friends to be able to connect, 
you'll need to follow my port forwarding guide that I'll link you to now. Again, thanks for watching my videos, please subscribe and give it a like.